Today, I'll show you how to do your Bit4X crypto taxes. Hello, my name is Nelly. Welcome back to another wallet integration video. Today, we're talking about Bit4X and specifically how to do your crypto taxes with the help of Coinly. So I'll tell you a little bit about this exchange, then I'll exchange and then I'll jump into the integration part of the video. And then lastly, I'll show you how to download the necessary tax documentation. So yeah, let's jump into it. So Bit4X was founded in 2017, currently based out of Hong Kong. It is a top 100 exchange by trading volume. They have a decent feature set but nothing really too crazy here. They do have a really nice academy where you can learn about NFTs, DeFi's, Web 3.0, and stuff like that. So definitely something that you should check out if you want to learn more about these topics. So in order to set up your um, Bit4X transactions, log into your Coinline account. Uh, if you don't have one, you can make one, it's completely free. But once you have that set up, go into the wallet section and click on add wallet. Then we're going to find Bit4X. As you can see, there currently is no API option. It's in beta, which means it's not available. Um, maybe that's subject to change when you're watching this video. Um, but for now, we're going to just go through the import from file option. So finding the CSV files um, and maybe one day the API will also be available. So click on import from file and then let me show you where to get those files from that exchange. First step is you're going to be logging into your account, of course. And then in the top right corner, you have an option that says orders. We're going to click on that. And then here we have spot orders and order history. So in the top right corner, there is a download CSV file option. Um, your area is going to be populated with a bunch of different transactions. You're going to download it. Now, there's one other thing to note here. Oh, this is your order history before 2022, 1030. So if you have transactions, you know, that are older than this date, you will need to do one of two things. You can either try contacting Bit4X to get those transactions, or you can create your own file, um, which I have videos on down below, you know, manual transactions and stuff like that. So most people, this will be enough, um, either this single file or a combination of two files, depending on how old your account is. Now, if you're doing any other kinds of things like perpetual orders or Bit4X Earn, currently I don't see any CSV files for that. So once again, you're gonna be left with two options. Try to contact them to get your transaction history or create your own file. Um, but make sure if you are performing some of these trades to, to get all of your transaction history into Coinly from the first day you open your account or the first trade you made till whatever tax year you're currently doing. So once you've downloaded that file or those files, depending on your situation, take it, drag and drop it into Coinly, click import, and there you have it. So that is the way to load your information to Coinly. Um, like I said, no API available. And if you do have some older transactions or if you're doing all kinds of trades, you might have to make your own file or request one, um, but that's the general procedure. So once those transactions have been imported into Coinly, um, you can click on transactions and review them, make sure everything is sitting right with you. Coinly has already done the most difficult part, which is, you know, calculate your capital losses and gains. And then after that, head on down into the tax reports area to get a summary of all your activity. So in this area, you get your capital gains, your costs and expenses, your income for the entire year, kind of see where your crypto taxes are going to end up. Once you're happy with everything there, scroll down and select a tax report that's appropriate for your needs. And as you can see on the screen before you, there is plenty of different documentation to go with. So for the US, we have the IRS Schedule D Form 849. Um, you can also export to TurboTax both online and desktop versions. We have reports for UK, Sweden, Norway, France, Switzerland, Australia, and then Canada, Germany, other countries. We have the complete tax report, which keep in mind is a document you can print off and give directly to an accountant to combine with your other tax documentation, or you can invite them to Coinly to set up their accountancy firm here with us. And then lastly, check your country's rules and regulations because this tax report might be deductible. But that brings us to the end of another wallet integration video. If you need further assistance, a bunch of different resources down below, Coinly Help Center, countless different articles on crypto tax related topics. We have a forum section if you like to talk to members of our community as well as our staff. We have a feedback section if you have any issues with our software. And then lastly, a contact section if you'd like us to message you directly, this is the area you would go to. But if you found this video helpful in any way, consider dropping a like, subscribing for more crypto content, and I'll see you next time. Peace.